Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to the next episode of the Ride to Riches series. Today, friends, we are heading out onto the lighthouse to work on Key to the Tower. Now, we have about 9% of what we need, so let's go and at least get the quest started. Key to the Tower, and we can turn in all of these parts. So the plexiglass, insulated tape, the two military circuit boards, and the transfer, and also the LCD. So the last thing we need to obtain is the transmitter body. And this thing has like, like 15 or 20 different locations it could be. We basically, have to just like search around the map and see if we can find it. Plans basically is just take our time, search two things, see what we can find. If we get into fights, we get into fights. If not, my objective is to simply find this item and get the heck out. Because if we find this now, then we have to wait 24 hours to the next time we'll be able to see it. And uh, yeah. That's pretty much how it goes. Also, for those that are been listening with the audio, I did some some tweaks today. The new cord came in, and a few other tweaks I did on my um, interface board for like the different volume settings, and whatnot. So hopefully there won't be as much like back and forth sounds. Let me know though in the comments as always, and uh, we'll go from there. But for now, we're gonna head out. We're gonna bring out the SR25, bring out the Bastion with everything else. Actually, I'm gonna buy one other thing. Money's a little low. I haven't really sold anything. That's why the money's still kind of low right now from the last episode. But as we were saying before, our focus is to get some other stuff done before I really truly worry about the money again. But we're going to get this guy on there. I almost forgot to put the plate back on. Put this on and put this on. Cool. So we're going to head out and see if we can locate the transmitter body. Are you ready? All right, let's do this. Oh, we got a... Oh, you know what? It's not my favorite spawn. I'll say that. It's definitely not my favorite one for this quest. I was hoping to spawn down by the shoreline so that way we could traverse around and see if we could get to the next spot. It's fine, though. We'll make it work. I think what I'm going to have to do then is I'm going to have to... I'm going to have to go backwards to go forward. There's really no other way around it. And I say this because... How do I put yeah, how do I put this? Yeah, if, if if I do it the other way around, if I go to water treatment plant first, there's a much higher chance I'm gonna die. It really is. I'm gonna have to go through every single person that's like rushing that direction. Versus, you know, this this may take me 30 minutes depending on where the thing's located. You know, if it's in the water treatment plant, which honestly is a higher chance of it happening being there versus outside of it. But at least it'll allow all the Excuse me? Who just shot at me? Oh, someone just shot at me. Um, what is that? I just shot one bolt and he was done. That's fine. We'll go around. Well, maybe I can't go around. I have to go all the way around. Well, I'm probably present. Um, I'd have to push all the way around, like, it's going to take probably like 30 minutes, but at least I know all the players will be gone, all the scav players for the most part will be all the way through. It's fine, me. I'd rather take my time on this. I can't really climb any of this stuff, so I'm going to be going right into this person. That's the only bad thing about doing what I'm doing right now. BSG, if you ever watch my videos, which I... I think VSU's watched some of my videos. It, uh, create another, you know, way to get across the water, please. You know, maybe one or two. Just so it's a little bit easier to get around this map. At least from the, past the river. Alright, let's climb this. Oh, I shouldn't have done that. <gasps> yep. I know it's gonna hurt my legs there. Uh, we're gonna go to the store first. Oh, shit check that one and then we'll start making our way up because my plan is once we do the big wrap around which is gonna happen we're gonna like we're gonna go from here from the store to the chalets down to the shoreline and check that one rickety shack that's out there in the water and then we'll take the beachhead all the way up and then go run like basically the, the side of the, the water treatment plant to get in this is probably the weirdest spawn to get. I, like I said, if I would have spawned in a much different one, I would have taken a much different route, but... It is a plan, at least. 
Well, I don't think it's going to be here. No, it's not. It's not inside the store. It's like right behind that little... Hold on. Let me pull my map. <laughs> so I, probably, I, was like, I was like, wait, I don't see my thing where I normally look to reference all the stuff. Uh, but no, it's not there. It would be behind that little desk there. All right. To the first chalet. Obviously, players are going to be fighting all over the place here. So... I may do like a zigzag motion here, and, I, and it may sound, you know, sound ineffective, which honestly it probably is. But what I may end up doing here is going through the chalet first, going across the way, going to the broken shack, then coming back up. Just depends. We got grenades being thrown, shots going off, so people are definitely still fighting over here. I'm gonna try to go through the front of this. I don't going the other way right now. Although if I remember right, I get stuck doing this a lot. I'm on up here. Once they had a fiasco again. So we got people at this chalet fighting, it seems. That's one person down. I don't have to worry about that. Well. Aren't we just having a ball shooting things and blowing things up? Just go do a big loop. I really wish I could climb up that, but I can't. It may be farther than what I'm thinking, too. I mean, the grenades are like going off, but it could be by the actual like garage on the other side. Oh, huh? we'll see. Head up this way. Just listening out for anyone that's creeping along. I don't know if I'd actually be able to see that from there or not. Is it in the box? It's not in the box. Okay. I was really hoping it'd be in the box, honestly. Go outside here. We're going to go upstairs. The second floor. I don't have my keys on me, do I? No, no, I, I don't have my keys on me right now. I just realized I didn't swap my keys from reserve. there either so then the next place that I could be here would be on top of the uh, the fireplace which I kind of looked there but I couldn't really see it fully but I'm gonna double check here again it is not up there okay well I think what we're gonna do then I'm going to do my original plan. I'm going to go all the way around. I'm going to lift this guy up. See what he's got on him. Light vision on. I'm actually surprised he didn't hear me when I stood up and zoomed in. when I Because I, I didn't realize how close he was to the, to the edge of the rocks there. I, I, I thought that gave away my position. 
Come over here. Oh, he had a thermal. Oh, this actually may be becoming very useful to us. At least I can try to locate players with it. M80s. Can at least unload the ammo. No, I really don't need this much ammo. Get this unloaded. I'm glad he wasn't zoomed, like scoping in, because he was kind of like close to looking at me, but <laughs> I got lucky. I got lucky he didn't actually see me. All right, let's do this. Let's drop these two mags. Oh, I did that totally backwards that I wanted to. Oh, well, get up. Let's get across the street. We're gonna head over to the broken shack first. And then we're going to that chalet. And then if it's not any of those bases, well, we're going to water treatment. All right, we made it to the shack here. So we're gonna check this. Gotta hurry this up. I got food being delivered soon. I just realized that, or remember that, I should say. Mm, can I climb up on the boat and get on top of here? I think I can. Maybe. Nope, nope. That was wishful thinking right there. Sorry, was going around. There's still some shots over at the chalet, though. But if we can get super lucky here, then I'll be happy. Come over here. I do have an SJ6 running, so I gotta hurry this up. Ah, not lucky. Unfortunate. Okay. All good, all good. We're gonna head over to the chalet next. Try to not waste this SJ6 as much as I possibly can. But like I said, there's still shots over that chalet, the one we're specifically going to right now, so we gotta be cautious. Once we get over this hill, we will try it. I do the scab, we're good. That actually may be farther now I think about it. see any signatures there. Hey, they didn't go on place. There you go. Oh no, the J6 routing out. That's super unfortunate. Granted, I got pretty far with it, but still. Oh man. It was just like, I was really hoping that we'll find it here because it is just a trek and a half to go through a water treatment plant to find it. We'll do it, of course, but kind of hoping we'll find it here. Well, climb it. There we go. I really do enjoy the vault system, but sometimes the vault system just does not work properly at all. So if it's here, Going to be inside or near this guy. And I do not see it. We're good. Ah, you keep that off. Way too bright. I want to guess that no one's actually going to be here anymore. They're going to be probably at water treatment, if anything. Come on. I'm trying not to jump and make a lot of noise, but eh, the game doesn't care. That sound was, but that sounded kind of close. Uh, 
right upstairs. And if it's here, it's going to be next to this. No, it's not there. So we're off to check this next. Wait, what did I just get a thing on? Oh, I thought something picked up saying I could pick something up over here. Let's see it there. Is it behind this? Uh, it's not. All right, well. <laughs> that means we're, um, I'm pretty sure. Actually, there's one more spot. Is there not? Oh, did I miss a spot, actually? I think I missed a spot in the in the other chalet. Uh, <laughs> hold tight, folks. Give me one moment while I take a look at this. I may have missed it. Why am I remember there being another one? There may be another one that I'm missing. That's why I'm just taking a quick look to see if I did miss it. Check that spot. Check that spot. Yep. Check that one. Yep. Check that too. Um, I think the map's kind of incorrect. Yeah. It says there's four locations. Which... Oh, is that the garage? No, that's not the garage. Oh, I see what it is. Never mind. Forget what I said. <laughs> it's uh, it's showing me basically like, oh, it's it could be over here in this corner, but it's like telling me something different. I don't know why it's saying that. Anyway, um, we got a lot of running to do. A lot of running. I was originally going to go straight ahead and continue through the side path because I was like, oh, that's the safest spot. But there's only one location that the editing can be actually on the left and it's on a rooftop. So I'm gonna one 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 Alright, Mr. Scav. Ow. Um so I'm gonna go this way. I'm gonna go through the water and then we'll go through the hole in the wall. That's gonna be the closest spot to go towards all the other stuff. Granted, I gotta be careful with players. I gotta really stop sprinting like I am. Sprinting is going to get me killed. I'm gonna go this way. Oh, why are you lagging? Stop it, Tarky. I don't see anyone over there. I fixed my legs up too. Kind of took a dip down a little bit. Took a little dip into a little crevice and hurt my legs. I would expect all these people to be long gone. But then again, I just saw tracers come my direction, so. Did you see a head? And why? What? I should have used the thermal, I guess, to look for people, but what? I didn't see anything when I looked at the footage, but maybe you guys could take a look and see if you saw somebody on the. Oh, uh, well, the original spot where I thought I saw somebody, which was the, like, the, the, what do you call it? Gunner's Nest? Yeah, we'll call it that. Because I thought I saw somebody, like, lay down or something, so maybe that's where he killed me from? That's the only place I could really think, like, me going from the outside of the wall to the inside of the wall, that he actually would have a shot. Because he just kept going and going and going. Who knows? Anyway, let's hope that we can actually find this part over here. Obviously, it's a high percent chance, like I said before, that it's going to be over at the rogues area, but we're here, so I might as well check it. And to bring out the MK47, because, I don't know, 
<laughs> it was already built for us. <laughs> Why not? Uh, let's go over here. I really just hope we're going to get lucky. It's not on the ground there. Not behind that. Okay. Go underneath here. I didn't see anything on the table, though I may miss something. Someone will pause it and be like, you missed this. Understandable. I'm kind of flying through all this stuff. Here, Dax. Oh, well. Actually, nothing. Surprising. Alright, so the dead body will check you next. Let's see near your hand. Yeah, it's not here. Okay, we'll keep moving then. Pretty much wearing the exact same thing that I was before, except for I got the MK-47. Everything is the same, basically the same. I got the black rock instead of the other one. Oh yeah, we should backtrack here first. Check out this last location here, and then we can have it to the other chalet, and then off we go in and search over at the water treatment plant. I'm trying to remember where I actually got all the BP from. I think I got all the BP for when we did the, um, just all those different quests. Shoot me through bushes, huh? I see how it is, scabs. Where's this one at? Oh gosh, I don't see him. He's farther on the beach. There you are. Oh, he threw a, Okay, he threw a flashbang. Okay, we're good. Oh, that had me clenching for a second. <laughs> I was like, oh god, don't do it, don't do it. Load the ammo in, in a second. It's a little messed up. No, I'm not getting that lucky today. Or as I can tell. No, it's not here. All right, well, get this ammo loaded up, and then we're going to make that long trek all the way to the other, well, I should say super long, but we have to go to the other chalet, and then we'll keep going. <coughs> oh, God. <coughs> oh, God. <coughs> oh, God. <sighs> no, Thor fix, fix, Thorax, fix, Thorax, fix, Thorax. <coughs> Oh, thank God. There's someone on the hill. Ow. He's got to have a thermal if he's going to be seeing me that easily. That sucks royally. But at least we didn't lose it. Not that. Unless he was really like staring that way. I don't. It could have been closer, I guess. This just seemed a lot farther away. Different route, I guess. That scared the crap out of me. I obviously knew there would be a slight chance that could have happened, but did not expect that. Arms are fixed up. Let's get going. Let's keep going. Where we need to go. Just gotta be careful though, because that's my left, obviously, with this guy. This is scab. I want to get inside though before he aims my direction. Get this off. Take a look through the place, see what we can figure out. I'm gonna take a look at the hill in a second. I feel like he's gonna keep trying to snipe me. It's not on the fireplace. I'll check the other thing downstairs in a second. Please be here, please be here. Nope. It's not on the side there. 
I don't think it spawns over here. Maybe I was looking at the wrong side. I don't think it was. I think I was looking at the right side. Yeah, I was looking at the right side. All right. Go over here. Nope. It's not here. And it's probably gonna be the water treatment plant. Let's, let's let's just be honest with each other. It's probably over there. But I gotta check all these places just in case, you know. I would hate for like me to get all the way to the end over here and then find out the things all the way on the other side of the map. It would literally be the absolute worst because I have to run so far away. I haven't heard any shots though over at the water treatment. I wonder if people are just getting in there super sneakily and ah. not having any issues. I really should fix them. Yeah, let's heal up the legs. Last thing I need to do is get shot in the leg and not be able to run. But we do have the shop over here that we can check. Over here. I almost feel like. Maybe I should start, like, if I spawn over there, always check the water treatment plant first, because it, like, if we keep saying it, there's always a higher chance it's going to be actually there versus over here, like on this side of the map. Oh, my land, so we're out of here. Stand by what I said. Gotta always check just in case. We're getting out of here. I may actually do some night runs on this map. Also, that was 19 strength that we just got. Very nice, very nice. Very, very behind in the strength department and everything else. I feel like my skills haven't been going up very fast this white. But just could be. Just a coincidence, maybe. Keep on moving. I don't care about the loot. This was all, like I said, about getting this part and getting out. The worst part about this is that I still gotta go look for that uh, USB after this. Well, not directly at this one. After this one, I gotta bring the device and do like a bunch of like, try to figure out the transponder thing, which is gonna fail, obviously, on us. And then after that, well, we're off to yeah look for that usb which is the most annoying part because it's so small and i believe there's more places than just the the uh, transmitter body to the side here all right cool let's get out of here i think i might honestly just drop off the tran trans transponder because i think we can do what they do it's just a bunch of xp we get and that's literally it so uh, I think I'm going to turn it in and we'll do another run of Lighthouse at night just to see what we can get. But I decided daytime. Just so we don't have to worry about thermal people. I got shot by a 7, uh, 762 by 51 I believe. I'm pretty sure it was like a S, uh, SR25. Uh, I might have to run to somebody over here. There's a good chance of it actually. Look out. Let's see what I find over here. Only problem is that, like, <clears throat> we always said this before, the spawns are pretty darn close. So, I gotta be very, very cautious about that. But again, depending on what, well, you know, who it is, it could easily be someone going over to the island, too, without have to worry about anyone coming my way. I don't see anyone. Okay, I'm gonna keep moving. I wanna get across the way, though, and, uh, go search up chalets, see what we can find there, try to kill some players, and so on and so forth. Because now it's the time where I can start making some money. But we got 24 hours, I gotta wait. Unfortunately, it's a, it's a very wonky 24 hours. I always try to do these, like, in a, you know, at, at a certain time, so I've always got time to film it. Basically, you're watching right now, when I complete this, was at, like, 10 a.m. 10 or, no, 10 p.m. Not 10 a.m. 10 p.m. So, I know I have to wait till 10 p.m. tomorrow. For the quest to show up again. So, I got time to do a little bit of looting and scooting and shooting and all that fun stuff. We're full. We are good to go. 
Well, so now for someone that maybe looking over the ridge. I think I'm just here myself. I thought I was hearing somebody, but I think I'm just here myself moving. Keep on going. That hundred mil isn't gonna make itself at the end of the day. I'm Was that shooting at? Or not? Must be on the other side of the hill, because I'm not sure. Not sure at all on that one. I was like, oh, perfect opportunity to catch people moving my way. Obviously, there's more than a high enough chance that someone's actually going to be here. Watch out for anyone peeking their head. <laughs> I think I killed him with the last bullet. Someone came by me. He's uh he's like on the other side of the wall here. Honestly, he probably would have been better off just trying to come around and get me because I would have never known he was here. Oh, some ammo. I dropped a mag somewhere. I think it's in the bush behind me. This guy sat here on the corner. They're waiting for someone to come across. And then the guy I think I killed that's behind me now is the one that spawned on the road behind us. The one where you go towards the exit for the rock fall. Pretty sure that's where he came from. Uh, search well, I'm going to have to get a new one. Just looking out for anyone. You obviously have the shots earlier. Also, hip firing right now is just so bad. I mean, I'm I'm just very lucky I actually killed that guy, the one in front of us behind that by the fence over there. I got so darn lucky that he actually died. I don't see anyone else coming? Someone's coming. Where are you, dude? I just heard you.
Did I just hear one? Yep, I heard one. Let's get that loaded. Well, assuming this guy kills somebody across the way, where's I'm guessing that's where he came from. That's now three dead, or should be four dead. Gotta guess you did not loot at all. As expected. I'm not even going to try to look for this mag. I would not know where to even start. Ooh, you had an MK2. All right, I'll take that. Oof, I shot him in the face. Ha! <laughs> My bad. Your armor's technically better than mine, so I'll take that. Take that for extra healing. Take that. I swear we'll get to the looting of actual objects in a minute after I'm done looting all these players. It's a really nice helmet, actually. anything good although I will take that oh shoot five did I not have that mark the whole time that's kind of scary all right we can go inside the building now seems the MKs are becoming very popular right now I, I would that's, there was another one there was another one there's always one more <laughs> god dang it ah. that was unfortunate so unfortunate I got, I'm pretty sure I died to an ump No, I died at 762. Man. Four players killed. That is just very unfortunate. Hmm. Well, shoot, I don't really have everything built right now. I've got a couple spears, but honestly, I don't want to use spears on Playhouse and I gotta come up with a build. So I think what we're gonna do is we're just gonna wait till the next episode. And uh, we'll continue. Honestly, tomorrow I'm going to be filming in the morning. So it's going to be just another loot and shoot. And uh, try to make something happen and get our money back. Because we got to wait a little bit longer before we actually are able to start working on the next part of the next part of the quest for working towards like a housekeeper. But we are going to get there slowly but surely. It's uh, just going to take a little bit of time. So um, I'm trying to think if there's anything else that we were doing in between. I don't think, I think that was it. I think the junk box, honestly, I can probably get rid of. I only have a few items left and they're not really used for anything. So I think we could honestly probably get rid of this soon because we have everything pretty much for item wise that we need to hold on to. I mean, multivitamins is like the only other thing, but I don't think we're going to do that quest anytime soon. Maybe I'll look at holding on to them. There's a few quests that maybe we're going to start doing, but we'll see how far we get. But anyway, I'm going to get out of here. We'll have to come back next episode and come up with a plan. And uh, hopefully we can take down more than four players this time and survive. So if you guys enjoyed today's episode of the Ride to Riches series, make sure you give it a thumbs up. Leave a comment down below what you enjoyed about the episode, what you say about it for the future. If you haven't yet, make sure you subscribe, the notification bell, and I'll see you in the next one.